guys, welcome. It's Avely hey and me. And welcome to Avely and me. Look who's back. My baby girl is back. My baby girl is back. And today we are going to paint and decorate this little pumpkin. Yes. <laughs> no, we're not going to eat it. We're going to paint it. So let's get started. So guys, we are pretty excited. We got our little matching colors going right here. Fall colors. Yes, all the paint. Every paint you can imagine. And we are going to decorate this pumpkin. So Emily, how are we going to start this pumpkin today? We are going to prep and we're going to use some painter's tape to prep. She's just more interested in the colors, I see. So I have some painter's tape. And I'm just going to randomly place it on the pumpkin. No particular fancy way. I'm just going to just make some random pieces and paste them. Ew, you want to help mommy? No, don't help mommy take it off. No. Look. Look at our guy. I'm going to press it down, make sure it's nice and flat. So we're going to make some strips, right? So we are excited about fall. We're excited about all the things we're going to try and we're going to do. So I figured we would start with this pumpkin together. Have any of you been to a pumpkin patch before? We haven't, but we hope to go to one soon and I'll be sure so make a quick video so you guys can see our adventures. She's so busy. She's looking for things that she can touch and feel. Yeah. Ah, so usually I would prep alone, <laughs> but I wanted you guys to see the process. So I'm just making some random shapes and sectors with this tape. So when Avery makes her awesome masterpiece on it, it'll be in like little sections, right? Mm. Of course, you're gonna try to take it off. <laughs> As I put it on, you're gonna try to take it off because that's what Avely does. What do you think? How do you think it looks so far? Now I could've made a scary pumpkin, but not really my thing. So I figured I would go with something abstract because it's Avery's art. What? Don't take it off, no! Why must you do this to mommy? Why are you like this? Wait, 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 we're almost finished. We're gonna get started soon. So like I said, I usually like to prep this <laughs> alone because it goes much faster and there's less interruption. So this is what I kind of look so so far. So some of the parts here, I'm going to divide them and then you don't want these little pieces that's left like this. You want to put a tape over it. So just a few more pieces, Ava, and we're going to be ready to paint. Mm. <laughs> no, why would you do that? Why must you do that to me, Ava? Why? Why, Ava Lee? Okay. So I've never tried this technique out. I've never really painted a pumpkin. So we're gonna learn today as we go. But I'm sure whatever or however it comes out is gonna be great. Because we're doing it together. And that's the whole idea. I've been doing these activities together, letting her be creative. Right? Okay, one more piece, one more piece, one more piece. She just can't wait to paint. I may put a little apron, well, not a little, a big apron on her so I can protect her onesie because it's really pretty and it's a pretty fall color and I don't want it to get messed up. Now, even though I'm pretty sure the paint will come off, it's going to be a little tedious to do, so why not just protect it in the beginning, right? All right, I'm almost finished prepping. All right, Ava, are you ready to get started? She's painting the pink palette. 
So this is what it looks like. So we have different shapes, different sections. All right, I'm gonna place it, make sure I press the tape down properly so that the paint won't seep underneath, you know? All right, girl. All right, baby, where's the brushes? This is your brush, you got one? Mommy wants a big brush too, and there's one here. Can I have one? No, it's not for your hair. It's not that kind of brush. It's a brush, but not for your hair. Can you want me to get a kiss? Can I get a kiss? <gasps> no. I... Thank you. Thank you. There'll be none of that today. All right. So I thought we were going to use random colors. Just any of the pretty colors that we have here. Right? No, this is not nice. that brush. No, it's not that kind of brush. This is a brush we used to paint with. All right, so let's get some apron on and let's get started with this painting. Why? All right, so we have our little apron on. <laughs> kind of created one for Ava. Pulled up those sleeves, right? All right, so what colors do we want to start with today? What color should we start with? You don't know? All right, I think we should start with the pink. All right, so I'm gonna put a little bit of pink on the palette, like so. Don't wanna use too much. I'm gonna wet your brush, just the tip of that. And I'm gonna put the pink paint on the brush. Hold it. Hold the brush. Good job, Mama. Like it? <laughs> Let's show you. So right now we're just gonna put some colors on. Put it on the pumpkin. Ooh, feels nice, right? Pretty? But now I want you to take this brush, hold it, and put it onto your pumpkin. Like that. Can you do that? No, not on your hand. Okay. <laughs> so now I'm gonna put a little bit of purple as well. And I'm gonna use another brush. I'm gonna use this brush. See, put a little bit of water. And then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to do another section like that. I think she just likes the way it feels in her hand. All right, let's put it on the pumpkin. Okay, so now it's become a hand finger painting kind of thing where we're just massaging the colors onto the pumpkin. I like it. I, I'm all for it. Go with it. You know what's happening? I usually do these little hand prints for cards where I have her sign her name. So we would put the paint onto her hand and then she'll place it onto the card so right now that's what's happening so this is what's happening as well oh blue okay we're gonna go some blue so like i said i'm not really sure how this is gonna turn out <laughs> i'm not but we're curious to see how we gotta use the brush mama And you rubbing it in. Good job. Okay. Daddy, Daddy, yeah. Daddy. Good job. Oh, look at these hands. Ah, but they're really pretty. Pretty hands. What color now? Some orange? Orange? Yes. Okay. Put a drop or two. I'm gonna get a different brush. Some water, orange paint. I mean, the pumpkin is already orange though, Ava. <laughs> Some yellow. I'm gonna put a little yellow there. And then the same orange brush, I'm gonna go into the yellow. Hold, 
Oh, it's a brush? Yes. On your hand, okay. Don't forget to put it on the pumpkin. Good job. Just gonna give you a little peek of the masterpiece that's going on here. I mean, I should just let her rub it in with her hand. What color? Red? This color? Yes. All right. So it's a little bit low, so we're gonna put just a very bright red. So I'm gonna put with a little bit of the pink. Rub it in, yes, go baby, yay! <laughs> Let's show them your hand. Ah, crazy hand, crazy hand. <laughs> All right, back to their pumpkin. What color now? This color? Wanna try this one? Or it might get murky. Let's go brown. All right. And then I'm going to go in with this color. Let's find a place that we didn't paint. Up here? Look. Yes. Maybe I should do something with a little bit of clay. Since she likes to have everything that she can touch and rub and feel. So the clay might be fun. That's something to try next. I like this. This is really pretty. Here, what about this side? We didn't mix that side in. Let me go back in with some other colors for her to mix in. Okay. No! <laughs> Don't touch her here. Let's rub, let's rub. Gentle. Gentle. She's like doing here. What color? More blue? We have blue right here. See? Blue. Look, we could come here. Mm. What color? This? Yeah? You really like this color, huh? Okay. I'm going to put just a drop. Ah! That's not a drop! That's a lot! Oh, no! Oh, no! All right, let's come here. Look. Gentle. You're doing such a good job. Look, give me high five. High five. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys. This is what it looks like. As mommy, I will go back in and finesse some parts. Yellow? We have yellow. That's what we do. But I still wanted her to get involved. I wanted her to feel the paint and try to decorate the best way possible. So pretty. Ta da da. Ta da da. The good thing about these abstract work that your kid does, you can always go ahead and clean it up a little bit when you're done. Hmm, what about this spot? Yay, beautiful work, beautiful work. Not yet, we don't take off the tape until it's dry. What do you think? Oh look, we missed a spot. Here, what's going on here? How about we go in with this color again? Yeah, good stuff. Good job, Ava. Creativity, freedom, mess, confidence. You're awesome. Do you know that? You're awesome. Who know? We use all the colors. Look, I got blue here. Where do you want it to go? Ooh, yes. 
Go ahead, honey. Go, go, go. Doing such an amazing job. Not yet. Let's just rub it all the way in. I feel like I need some more purple. I'm gonna keep rub. She's literally just rubbing paint around. All right. <laughs> That's our pumpkin. Get some spots at the bottom we're gonna touch when the top is dry. Yeah. She's not done yet. Just one drop. Where would you like me to put it? Up here? All right. We're gonna let this dry a little bit and we're gonna go and do the bottom. And then we're gonna take the tape off, which she's starting to do right now. And we're gonna see how it comes out. Yes? Mm. More blue. Do you really like blue? Mm. Mm. Yeah, I have a lot of it right there. See this color, this nude beige peach? It's right here. So all we have to do is pick it up with the brush like so. Wait, not yet. Still drying. Still drying. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna put our brushes in that we didn't really use. Keep it on the apron. Good job. So while my little one is taking a quick nap, I'm gonna go ahead and finish our pumpkin that we started. So using a very small brush, I'm gonna continue doing some black lines around the parts that have the paint, as you can see. So let's speed this up, okay? All right, so here you're gonna see me get some black paint, a small brush, and I went over those free forming shapes that was made by the tape, and I decided to make them look a little bit more distinct. And the mess that the tape might have left behind, because some of the paint seeped under, I took a Q-tip with some water and I just went in there and cleaned it up. And I just decided, hey, I can jazz this up a little bit more. I got some white paint, that seam small brush, and I went ahead and made a few little unique symbols in between where the tape was. Well guys, I went ahead and finished up our pumpkin. My little one had to take a nap. I'm sorry, so she was not part of this process. So I went ahead and got a small brush, added some abstract details to it to make it even more special. What do you think? Not bad, right? And I'm happy that she was a part of the whole process. So when she sees it, she can be very proud and say, hey, I helped, right? So this is the final, final thing. I think it's a very special, it's very unique, and it represents us. All the messy colors and the really cool details. I'm impressed and I love it. And I hope you guys give this a try with your little one or by yourself, why not? And I hope you have a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. There's just one final touch that needs to be added to this pumpkin to make it oh so special, and that's Avery's handprint signature. I've done it to a lot of her cards, and I figured, hey, this would really put our pumpkin over the top and exactly where we want it. So I add some black paint to her little hand, and then I try to position the pumpkin as steady as I possibly can, and then place her hand onto it. The first one did not come out so good. Actually, it looked like Wilson from Castaway. You remember the volleyball? If you know, you know. <laughs> okay, so I tried it the second time and it came out even better. And that was it. Now, this process will be very messy, so make sure you have some wipes and paper towels handy because it could get really messy, but it was fun nevertheless. Until next time, the new peas, the new
love sending you light from my little bestie and myself. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thanks for watching, Avely and me. Bye-bye!